Hello everybody, this is Dr. Ben Lim and in this series I'm talking to you today about the seven different names of God which are the seven attributes of Jehovah. Jehovah is the name called Lord, is his title, it's who he is. And today I want to talk to you about Jehovah Ra'a. Someone say Jehovah Ra'a. Now this word is incredible because this word Ra'a means God our way and shepherd. Don't you love it that God never leaves you in the blind? He never leaves you in the dark. He never leaves us or forsakes us. He is our wonderful shepherd. He is our guide. In fact, in the New Testament, our parakletos, which is the name of the Holy Spirit, he's the one who is beside us, assists us, walk with us, is side by side, gives us counsel, gives us advice. He is our parakletos. He is one with us and he is by our side. And Jesus is our good shepherd. He will guide you. He will lead you. Have you ever felt like you're in the valley? Well, the Bible says, even if you're in the valley, the shadow of death, of darkness, he will be there. He will lead you through. And I declare unto you, God is leading you through. He's guiding you. He's giving you wisdom and direction. I know many people today seem confused. Am I this? Am I that? Am I a man? Am I a woman? Am I this or am I that? But these thoughts of confusion are not of God. God gives you the power of a sound mind. And He leads you and guides you by the truth of the Spirit of God. God wants to set you free and lead you by the Spirit of truth. Psalm 23, we see this. He is Jehovah Ra'ah. God our way and shepherd. Isn't that incredible? He is the way, the truth, and the life. He is our good shepherd. The prophet Jeremiah talks about good shepherds and bad shepherds. There are bad shepherds. These bad shepherds are like wolves in sheep clothing. They will give you false words, false prophecies. They will discourage you, manipulate you. They will use you, abuse you, tear apart your innocence, and they will take advantage of you. However, God is setting up good shepherds. He is setting up people who will know the voice of the shepherd. All you have to do is silence yourself and ask God to lead you. Are you in charge? Or is Jehovah Ra'ah in charge? Let me tell you, many of us will not go through the warfare, difficulties, or consequences if we were led by the Lord. Is your flesh leading you? Or is the Holy Ghost leading you? He is our great chief, perfect shepherd. He is our way. And if you surrender yourself and yield yourself to the Lord, He will lead you. He's not a bantering, battering, butchering God. He doesn't beat you, but He encourages you. He's a gentleman. He encourages you, counsels you, walks with you, speaks tenderly with you. Jesus cares for you, his sheep. Hear the voice and may you prosper and enter into life. In John 10, the Bible says that the enemy comes to steal, kill, and destroy. But Jesus comes to give a life in abundance. Are you ready for that abundant life? As you are being led by the Lord, you will go from glory to glory, victory to victory, breakthrough to breakthrough. You will continue to ascend the hill of the Lord. Let Him lead you. Let Him walk with you. If you need direction in your life, call on to the name Jehovah Ra'ah. He is our way and our good shepherd. He will lead you. Trust in Him. Lean not in your own understandings, and He will make your ways straight. Jehovah Ra'ah is His name. He knows the map. He knows the way. He knows how to get you from point A to point Z. He's the author and the finisher of our faith, 
and he will walk with you and lead you into the promised land, the way of glory. This is Dr. Ben Lin, and I pray for peace, clarity, and for guidance and direction with all that you do, all that you say, all that you are partaking of. May God lead you as you trust in Jehovah Ra'a. God bless you, and may you receive the supernatural guidance of our shepherd. He wants to lead you more than you want to be led. God bless you, and thanks for watching. Till next time.